Let's go. Oh my god. I got the heavy duty two wheel drive car as well. Well, I guess I have to bite the bullet. Oh my god. Yeah. Mm. Uh, this is. This is Sweden for you. I'm in a bit of a pinch. I need to get my uh, heater that I have in this cabin because I thought it would be a nice place to store it. But. Uh, I need to fix my Volvo because I need some cash pretty darn quick because I have an, a bigger project on the horizon, horizon. and yeah, it's knee deep and I have a an old trail <laughs> underneath the snow but I haven't been here for a couple of weeks <sighs> okay so uh, yeah I have a bigger project coming up and I need I need to get my thumb out and, and do something about that Volvo and flip it and get some cash uh, I will probably, <laughs> yeah, well, you, you will see, you will see. Uh, and yes, I got a new jacket for my work and it lasted one whole day or 24 hours. And then I had a major hydraulic leak on the front in the blade uh, a constant flow hydraulics with the high pressure and uh, I sprayed the whole cap and uh, yeah minus 16 17 degrees so I thought long and hard if I was going to uh, do do it in my only in my shirt or if I but it was too freaking cold it's it's no game. It's no game in this climate. And that's why I need to get my heater uh, down to my shop and so I can work there. I'm going to uh, I'm going to start the diesel engine. Uh, that will be a uh, will it start because that has been sitting for uh, two years. So I haven't been in here for a while either. Yeah. So this is my propane heater. Because I, I need to, I need to speed, speed my process up a bit. Uh, I, I, I was going to wait for the, uh, another one. Okay, just bite the bullet. It's up to my knees. Oh, and a little more. I hate winter and I hate cold. I live here, yeah, fantastic. And this one handed is always a treat. Let's see.
Just have to. <laughs> this is a bit further up than where I live, so there's about. I don't know how much. I think I will go with the tube first. Let's try to make a make a trail in the snow. Yeah, we get more snow up here and and down in the in the village. Oh, and I, we're about to get 20 more centimeters tonight, but they. They threaten with the rain, so let's see. I'm going to head out for work tonight, so that should be interesting. Uh, yeah, this is this is great. Uh, and <laughs> filming it at the same time is. That's, that's all for you guys. Yeah. This is a really nice place in the winter. I should spend more time here, but you know. This is a decent sized spruce. Okay, that's the, that's the easy part. Good, nice Toyota. Nice Toyota. And you should just need to do like that. Nice. You know the drill. One, two, three, four, five. Seven, eight. Ah. Yes. Mm. Oh, that's not 
heavy at all. Ah. Okay. Okay. Oh, just ignore that. Ignore that. Damn it. Yeah, ignore that. Ah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ah. Oh, that looks safe. Nice. Well, oh. I'm not in the in the best of shapes. The best of shape I'm usually at in November, after you know, or at the end of the of the forestry season. But, uh, yeah, uh, let's say I'm not, uh, I'm not going back in the forestry industry anymore, that I know of anyhow. The company that I worked for has uh, lost its contract at the place that we, oh my god, uh, at, at the place where we worked, so that, that isn't, uh, that's not going to happen anymore. So, <laughs> I've got an idea, and I need a bit of money for that, so I'm going to fix up my Volvo terrain vehicle, military electric company terrain vehicle, and uh, sell it because the, the prices are sick. I don't know what I'm going to get for mine, but I need, I need that money to... I need that money to start my own business. Yeah, I said it, so I guess it's the truth. So I need the heater done in my shop so I can fix that, sell it, and start my own business. Yeah, that wouldn't be a problem these days. No. No, no. Yeah. Uh, I feel like Captain Kleeman. I think I'm going Captain Kleeman on y'all. But, uh, yeah, I really like his uh, his videos. So, might have borrowed something from him. I don't think he cared because he uh, seems like a, a guy who just goes with the flow. I don't know. <laughs> uh, he's in a hurry. Trying to get to the YouTube yacht in March, and I have a similar deadline with my terrain vehicle to flip that probably in March and get some money for it and get myself uh, self employed. Yeah, that's not a scary thought. Just, just a thought, or just scary, I don't know. Well, I haven't got time to sit there. I need to go install that heater. <sighs> oh. I'll catch my breath a bit. Yeah. This is a quick and dirty video, but I'm in a bit of a hurry and I haven't got my filming hardware 
at hand. Oh my god, it cuts into my hand pretty bad. <sighs> As always, yes. A spare tube. Okay. Yeah, so I need to play a bit of a. Uh, Tetris game here. I need to fix fix the welder. That's a that's a quick job. Uh, I should open that one up because I need the uh, platform for this engine. I show this shown this a couple of times. Uh, I'll build that platform to uh, put it on and start it before I get it into the to the truck. This is a Mercedes OM603 something turbocharged. Uh, I have uh, I had a leak in the o-ring between the fuel pump and the Timing cover thing block, whatever it is, it's the engine block. So it seeped oil from there, plus I had some other issues. I had a broken frame, so I fixed that. So the frame was good. Uh, let's see, the frame was good. And then I got the oil leak, plus I had a destroyed... Uh, I had a destroyed uh, gearbox. Luckily, I had a gearbox. It's underneath, under that green plastic. I had a, a spare gearbox, so that's been... Uh, I changed the seal front and back. Seems uh, to be in order. Don't know, but... Uh, uh, this was all ready to be put in. I was waiting for the fuel pump that I sent off to be... Uh, rebuilt so that's rebuilt and tested and good to go S slightly improved and good to go so that's that's going to be a nice one i, I drove uh, how far did i drive two thousand kilometers with that engine in this truck so this is a volvo c303 army truck but this has a civilian Civilian, uh, this was bought by an electrical company, uh, government electrical company actually. So they built a couple of these. So these have, these have all the goodies. It had a, it, it has a winch that drives off. Yeah, that's that's not dark at all for you. Uh, you have to trust me. It has a winch. It drives off the the. Uh, PTO. Let's see here. Got this fancy yellow hook. So that's that's uh, that's uh, big money in that thing. Only that thing. Only the winch. And then I have. Uh, then I have. I have. I have. Let's see. Steering servo. On the column, so I have the column is connected to the to the original steering, so I have contact with the wheels from the steering wheel to the wheels. So that's a assist servo or whatever you call it. It's phenomenal. Uh, so I have a bit more than your regular army truck. I have some nice seats, though not nice seat covers but yeah. better seats than original what else do i have i have insulated panels all all around these fancy lights inside also original uh speakers original what else do i got 
Yeah, that seat and two extra seat. That's that's those seats are for, from the army truck. And this big gaping hole down here is where the engine sits. So I love this truck. That, that's that's that was my pride and joy. I have this fancy LED light on top. Uh, fire extinguisher. Uh, I don't know. And I have a lot of parts and goodies in here. So I think I have everything to get this. Get this. And I have this small LEDs. Two there, one on the back, and two on the other side. Just to do a lot of. A lot of hunting with this, you can't see much. You have to trust me. I have a new clutch. Uh, new new clutch. What else do I got? I got a, I got a it's 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 a lot of money laying in the that back seat in parts. Uh, so I guess the next update on this will be will it start i sure hope so uh, yes well <laughs> ah no sweat everything's just fine see you next time let's go Let's <laughs> go.